So I just got back from my local Target. A little surprised as I was uh, digging through the new section they have at the back of the store for collectible cards that uh, the new Topps uh, 2019 Allen Ginter were in stock. And they had these uh, value packs, which are sort of interesting compared to some of the others that I saw on the shelf. And some blaster packs as well. So thought uh, with them being out a day early, I'd uh, get to ripping and sort of check these out. I'm new, or I should say back to collecting. Um, haven't really been in it for almost 20 years at this point and sort of excited to see some of the different cards that are out there. Really have gotten into the 2019 Gypsy Queen as well as the Bowman Chromes and uh, thought I'd give these a try. Uh, here we got uh, Brendan Nimmo. Um, kind of matte finish on these. Whitey Ford. Kind of cool to see some of the old cards, old players in here. Felix. Dakota Hudson. John Lester. Boo. Not a Cubs fan. Brewers fan. Uh, JD Martinez. Yeah, oh, that's kind of interesting. Roger Hornsby. Here's my first uh, mini card. Gone Makata. It's kind of cool. Francisco Lindor. This kind of reminds me of the tarot cards that you'll see in Gypsy Queen, but instead this is with their sign. It's a Scorpio. Kind of cool. Ty Cobb mini card. Kind of interesting. I see some of these had frames uh, for myself. Uh, I haven't quite seen that yet, but I'm curious if that's just an option with these cards. Ah, flying machines. I heard that uh, this and weapons were sort of uh, parallels. Um, history of flight, monoplane, really, really cool. Um, as a aviation geek, that's definitely something that I dig. Sterling Marte, Matt Chapman. JT Real Muto. Let's see what the second pack has in store for us. As I said, I've just gotten back into collecting after probably giving it up sometime in the early 90s. So if you guys have any tips for me, I'm all ears. Oops, don't want to reveal those quite yet. Um, let's see here. Emily Jameson. Minor League Baseball. Coley Allard, it's a rookie card. Pudge Rodriguez. Didi. Harrison Bader. Not a St. Louis fan. Go Brewers. Uli Adamas. Seems to have so much present, uh, potential, but hasn't quite uh, captured it quite yet for Tampa. Rizzuto. That's kind of cool. Mike Trout. One of my favorite players of all time. Really dig the look of that one. And apparently, a horse is a thing this year as well. From El Reyes. Ah, there's a brewer, Paul Molitor. Keeper for me. Love you, Carton. And uh, Siberian Husky and Hippopotamus mini <laughs> card. Um, not sure if I'm digging these quite yet or not. Kind of weird. I want them to just be all baseball cards, but I'm rolling with it. Last pack we have here. Feels like some good inserts again. Adam Ottavino, Eric Hosmer, Dion, Neon Sanders, looking old in this one. Wanted to be uh, Bo Jackson, just couldn't. But then, then again, so did Terrell Buckley. Liz Dargle. Jason Veritek, mini card. Alex Rodriguez, long before he started taking the juice. Max Scherzer, I think one of the best pitchers I've ever seen pitch. Uh, besides having two different color eyes, this guy doesn't mind pitching with a black eye. Awesome dude. 
Robin Hood's bow. That's one of those weapons that I've sort of heard about. Cedric Mullins, rookie for San Francisco. Um, this is kind of cool. Ryan O'Hare. And that is a uh, autograph. Um, kind of interesting that it's encased. I didn't expect that. I thought it might just be a free case sitting around it, but that's pretty awesome. Another oldie, Catfish Hunter. Andrew Benatendi. And Mitch Keller. Brad Keller. So that's it. Um, Got to say, for uh, I think $5 a pack, it's a pretty nice pool. Definitely digging that over the other mini cards that I had saw. Got a nice Paul Molitor. Certainly the Mike Trout. Some of the uh, cards like this. Really digging it. Well, that's it. Might have to head back and get some more at a future date. Thank you for watching.